Hi guys, welcome to another Living in SATV video day for you. So today we're going to speak about the mega project that will happen around 2026 in the Eastern Cape in what we know already as Kura Development Zone or basically the most successful SEZ in the country. If you guys have been following the channel, you guys know what I'm talking about. So if not, go to the mega project playlist that I will list down below. But let's see this amazing project guys, because ammonia is aka one of the fuels of the future. Stay tuned because once again this video will blow your mind. It's a massive green field site. Thousands of hectares of land in Nelson Mandela Bay in the Eastern Cape. Its backers, Hive Energy, say that the $4.6 billion green ammonia project will be sustainable and create thousands of green energy jobs. We looked at sites all over Africa, all over the world, and we came to the inevitable conclusion that this would be the best site to set up a green ammonia plant. And there are many reasons for that. They have infrastructure in place, road infrastructure, there's the water desalination plant, so we've got fresh water available to us. There's plenty of land, there's over 9,000 hectares of available land here. Demand for ammonia is growing internationally. Its main use is to make fertilizers and explosives in mining. But it's a cleaner green version that is being touted as having a bright future. Green ammonia is normal ammonia that's made using renewable energy, so it's completely clean. It's not made using fossil fuels. This means this is a completely clean process. Its potential as an alternative fuel for the shipping sector that's exciting the industry most. It will start replacing heavy fuel oils for ships and it will replace diesel. So that will become the fuel of the future, particularly in the maritime industry. Preparations for the construction of the plant are already underway. It's set to create thousands of jobs in a region where they are badly needed. For us in the Eastern Cape, the unemployment rate is sitting at over 50%. So which means an, an investment of this nature with the number of jobs that are going to be created, it's going to be very big. Hive Energy says it plans to create 20,000 construction and permanent jobs and that more will be created when they begin exporting to the continent. Both Mozambique and Zambia import ammonia. They import they have huge commercial farms and ammonia is an import for them. We see huge opportunities in Africa for inter-trade, cross-border cooperation. Hive Energy says that it aims to begin production of green ammonia at the plant in 2026 and that through its greener energy alternative, it should help in climate change mitigation. Eleni Jokos, CNN.